all right youtube this is your boy the very system and here again we are here to do the chiri chiri chara chara and then to do we learn how to install a laravel e-comment software um that i have on my system today and um i've already extracted it on a folder called the flea card and then um, i've created a database with the same name to as well which you'll be using to do um our installation now if 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 you are a beginner i have a previous tutorial that shows you how to create a database in php my admin and how to extract um your application on a folder in your server to um carry out the installation so please if you're a new beginner do refer back to my previous tutorials for that process so without wasting my time i'm going to open a new tab and then um we start with the installation process okay let me just use the old tab here i have um, local host then i have flea card then that is going to start my installation process yeah but it opened the content of what my flip card folder so that means i have to click on uh, my public folder to um continue with the application installation but what i need to do is that i want to create an index file now when you look at um um the content of um the e-commerce card for damn um, documents you see that we have, we have no index file there so what i'm going to do is i'm going to um create an index file and redirect that index file to um my public folder so what i'll do is i'll right click here then come to new then um new text document and i have index.php then i'll open that file i'll open it then um i'm going to open the php tag then i have a um, header um, dot location column um, my public folder so now this is the code that i need to redirect um, my public folder so um anytime i open the application i don't need to click on public folder or um, the content of um um, our folder to be displayed so what we need to do is that because if you leave it this way and um a client comes to um type your domain name then automatically it takes the client to um to see the content of the files but to prevent that we are redirecting um or changing the location to read from the public folder which is the main starting folder of um our document so now what we need to do is that i need to refresh um my um, browser and then that is going to load the installation process for me because it's going to redirect um, to the public folder and that will load my installation for me so um, our installation process has started and at this point um, all checkups on my server is okay then i'll move to next to continue with the installation and here i'm supposed to provide my server details database details and other things and so forth so um my database username is avanash and password that you already know and then the database um, that I created is um, Flickard. And then we have um, username, which is um, Avenash. And then um, we have um, email address that I'll be using to log in. So I have admin at um, dvs.com, um, which is the virus systems.com. Then um, password that I'll be using to log in. So I'll be using um, um, Pandic 006 then i have pandic 006 okay let me change it to my usual um you send me a password which is some um, avenash um at gmail.com so um let's stick with that i believe a lot of people know that so um we have um the virus systems we have store email address now i can have admin at um dvs and a search engine is sql so we'll proceed with our installation we hit on the install button and this is now going to install all the database file into the database so let's give you some few seconds and when it is done then we come back to continue with our installation process all right so our installation is done and here we are at the complete page where we can visit our shop or we log into the admin page so if i hit on go to shop and then it opens another new tab and then it will display my shop for me and here i am with um, a new fresh um, e-comment application um, website running on my local host and then if i hit on the admin button that is going to take me to another new tab and then log me into uh, my admin page so i select my email address and password to log into the system so um that is how to um 
um, installed um, um, this e-comment application on your local host and it's still the same procedure um, installing it on um, your live server so please do stay with the virus system and if you like my tutorials please subscribe to my channel leave your comments and then like the videos to as well and don't forget to visit our facebook page which is um, facebook.com slash the virus systems so please stay with us till our next tutorial